Hi, it's Tina and Tim again, and staying along the topic of Child Protective Services, what can a person expect at the initial home visit by a caseworker? All right, I will try to keep it quick and follow up maybe with some more questions and answers later on, but the initial visit, the caseworker will come out. They will, of course, announce who they are, and they'll let you know why they're there and that a report has been opened. They will give you a, a letter that says you are either the subject or not the subject of the report and what the allegations are. They will also tell you that you know, either they have spoken to the child already at school or somewhere else, or that they need to speak with the child and they need to speak with you. In that initial home visit, they're gonna ask to do a home check, which means they're gonna walk through the house. They're gonna assess the home, make sure there's plenty of food, uh, make sure it's clean, it rises to a level that you know stays within the level of New York State standards for cleanliness and inhabitability. They're gonna see where the children sleep. They're gonna kind of make notes to make sure safety concerns are all there. Uh, they'll have a packet of paperwork for you to fill out along with releases of information for doctor's offices and things like that. They're gonna have a list of questions for you as they begin in the investigation to kind of build whether or not they have information to substantiate the claims within the report, or it doesn't quite rise to that level uh, of burden of proof uh, that they require or the state requires in order to indicate the report or unfound it.